Welcome to Weller Tools here at IPC Apex. I'm delighted to be joined by Diane Regan and uh, of course uh, Marcel Tenner here who's the Global Product Manager. I'm going to start with you first of all, uh, Diane. I mean, you've, Weller has embarked on a lot of innovation in this past year. Uh, can you talk us through some of the, the, the key highlights? I can. It's been very exciting for us. We have been doing a lot of research with the, the end users, doing a lot of voice of customer throughout the globe. Um, and one of our exciting launches was the tips that we have, the Ultra tips, Pico tips, mm -hmm. um, and the RT tips. It was an extension of our active tips that we already had, um, but it was they're better, they're faster, and now in addition to that, we are stepping up our WX platform to a WX smart, which is going to make our tips smart as well. And yes, so that's where Marcel can give us some detail on, on the innovation and mm -hmm. the technical. And how yeah. it works. Yes. Okay, excellent. Well, thank you for that. So, um, Marcel, I mean, the, the stations we see behind us obviously are fitted with these new uh, Pico tips uh, that you introduced. Um, how, how did you make them smart? So, yeah, we put in their RFID chips to make them more intelligent. So the, the good thing is now that we can offset them from the factory on. That means that the tips will be much more precise in detail and, and can also collect much more data in the future. So that will help also our customers in terms of traceability and other features to provide much more data over to them and giving them real value. So you get full traceability of the use of the iron, uh, what the temperature excursions have been, how long the operator has been working with it. Yes, exactly. It's a complete smart system right now. So in the past we had a smart station, then it was going to a smart um, iron with parameter storage on it. And now the really last step on it is really getting also the tip intelligent in this case. So that's our next generation of high-end soldering stations. And, and I guess one of the, the other features of these new tips, of course, is, is the, the speed of ramp up. Uh, so, the, you know, there's much less delay for, you know, people who are doing a lot of hand rework. Absolutely. So it's a very fast um, heat up time from two to seven seconds. And what we also did is we could combine the micro and nano tip range into one, one, solder, one single soldering iron. So instead of having three irons, now we can build up everything within two irons with a smart soldering tip. So that's also a very unique thing in the market. Now, talking, to, talking about the data, um, what do you do with the data? Do you put that into a system that uh, you hold or do you put that up into a cloud or do you put that onto an MES system? No, so we are, we are not putting the data in a cloud, but we are allowing our customer to collect all the data. And what we provide is the connectivity within the station, Wi-Fi, LAN connection, to make it possible to store all the relevant data in their ERP system. Mm -hmm. And we are supporting for sure here also the IPCFX as a Weller supporter. Okay. Now, the, the setup of the uh, tip is, is uh, fairly unique and quite uh, easy. Can you maybe tell us how, how that happens? Yeah, I would show it on that station, probably very easy. So just coming back maybe from the station, so we had in the past five, five WX stations in the range. So we co combined them all together into one, one single station. So modularity is a very important topic for us. So the installation of the iron itself now um, is getting very smooth. Um, you just have that plug and play that's also patented by uh, weather technology. So it's tip to grip very easy is getting the tip very stable and the only thing you can really have a tool less change with this tool is plugging it in and you are already ready to start so also removing it's going very fast you plug in the new tip in a couple of seconds and it's heating up already in a two two to seven seconds uh, to the full temperature so you don't need to calibrate it you don't need to calibrate it right, but there are a lot of needs in, in the industry from uh, medical device manufacturers, but also military uh, aerospace or even quality management uh, from a uh, department wise, uh, which are asking um, for calibration or wish to have it proven on paper that there was a calibration and that you're very accurate and precise with the temperature to make sure that the product later on is working. So we are able to perform uh, with this product auto calibration which means we are simply connecting it with an RS232 on the back side and with this new smart intelligent tips 
all uh, the operator has to do is going on the thermal cobble and everything will be automatically offset in the tip itself. So we will have it auto calibrated. And the interesting thing here with the connectivity is that uh, we can save that data and information very easy for the customer so he can easily deliver it. Well, it seems a very slick system. Um, it's been well thought out and uh, certainly very presentable. Uh, presumably all the different alerts are built in if, if the operator starts to go outside of the process window. Absolutely, yeah. yes. So there's a total process control. What we are also delivering within this new product is uh, remote management uh, for supervisors. So there will be uh, an Android app, but also an Apple app and Windows app available to have full remote management, but also real-time data available from our side. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so we can track the full process and have a full process control on an operator level to make sure that the quality management is very high. Excellent, excellent, okay. So, uh, once again, uh, what's the name of the, the system again, the Weller? The, the system is the WX Smart, so it's the next generation of high-end soldering stations and we are looking forward to launch them end of the year. Okay, so they're, they're not actually available yet, they're, they're, they're due to come out end exactly. of this year? Yes, so we showed it the first time up on the last trade fair in Germany on Produktronika and now showing it the first time uh, live um, in the USA, in San Diego. Well, it's, uh, it certainly looks a very impressive system. I want to thank you for showing us it today and we wish you every success with the, the launch when it's ready. You're welcome. Thank you.